Hello, welcome back to Dr. How. Today we're going to be talking about Blake 7. We're going to be talking about one of my favourite episodes, City at the Edge of the World. Now, this is the episode where Villa is uh, stolen away by Baban the Butcher, this uh, unsavoury character here. And he's given a task of breaking in through a door, which, uh, as it turns out, is not actually a door. This is actually a, a force field, and he uses this this probe device to uh, push a probe through very, very slowly so that the uh, the force field uh, breaks down. And uh, Carol is the uh, fighter who's working with Bayban. This was the favourite uh, story of uh, Michael Keating, uh, who played Villa, uh, because, uh, as he said, it's the one where Villa uh, finally gets the girl. Um, and here she is, uh, having changed. So if you have a look at the doorway, you can see uh, what we've got here is the, the probe in front of the doorway. Uh, Villa moves away from the door. Villa moves away from the door and then the door uh, it's got this electricity effect going on, and then the door vanishes. But you can see the problem. The, the probe is actually not visible in this particular shot. If you go back and have a look at some of this electricity, you can actually see that the electricity sort of starts on the bottom of the, the screen and moves upwards. And probably what they've got, you can see it reflected here, there's probably got a light inside some sort of cylinder that, that they're rotating to make this effect. It's quite effective. Uh, the problem is uh, the the probe's not visible, so we're going to put that probe back. So what I've done is I've cut out the probe from an earlier shot and I've pasted it on over the top there. And as you can see, I had to do two different versions. There's the the ordinary version there, and then there's a, a version that's been lit up blue to match the uh, the surrounding effects. Technically, if the light was actually coming from the this electricity effect going across the door, this should actually be in silhouette, but uh, it's a case of give, giving the, uh, the viewer what they expect rather than doing something that's actually physically plausible. I mean, how did this light appear over here from this electricity? Uh, so we, we just have to match the visuals on the shot, and this is the kind of thing that we, we end up with. And uh, then you can see that they, uh, they step through and the, and the probe's there again after they've when they come along there. So that's the that's the correction that we're trying to apply. The basic idea is that we go to um, we go to a shot, an earlier on shot, and basically round about here, somewhere where Villa has moved away from the uh, from the probe, and then we can actually just cut that out in GIMP, and we end up with um, an uh, we end up with a isolated shot of of the probe on a on a transparent background, um, and then I've got a few versions of that. Um, one of the versions has got the uh, has been lit up uh, like the electricity. So uh, with a little bit of blending, we can actually put that together, and this is what the the finished shot looks like. I'm Dr. Howe. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Bye.